Hello YouTube, it's William here with GoPro Knoppers Trains, and today I have another unboxing video for you guys. I don't really plan to make a habit of making these, it's just that I haven't uploaded in a couple days, and I need to boost my uploads, because unfortunately I'll be kind of busy for a little while. I have some really, really fun packages for you guys to look at today, so I'm just going to go ahead and jump in. These first two right here are for, from some good friends. Um, this one specifically is from a YouTuber by the name of Dirty Dan. Go check him out. He has some really, really excellent content. So we're going to go ahead and just open these right up. And I have to try and do this off camera because my Sharpie's not working for whatever reason, so I can't black out the labels. I did my best. Okay, and there's a little more tape. So far, looks well packaged. And this one that is in here, I'm very excited for. However, it's gonna be difficult to find everything to make it proper. If you see that tender, you should know what's in here. Here it is. The River Aussie President Fillmore, or as we like to call him, Big Phil. I'm super excited because this one has the cab mounted motor. And while not more desirable than the red box version, I really like the silver rims on it. Looks like the shell came a little bit loose in shipping, just needs to be snapped back into place, but that's something I can always do later. Um, I'm not on the layout today simply for convenience sake. I literally just walked in the door with these things. I was so excited to unbox these. This one is from Commanding Officer Kanawa. I hope I pronounced that right. Another friend of mine who I've been talking to quite a bit recently. I'm just gonna go ahead and rip right into this one. And I'm not trying to be rough or anything. It's just that I can't really show you any of the shipping details because that would give away my address and the address of some other people that I know who would probably rather remain at least in that respect, anonymous. So we'll pull this out. Uh, he did tell me it was in a cornerstone box and this box is probably a little bit wide for this thing. However, it's super light and it's well packaged. So I believe I have no reason to worry. Let's go ahead and pop this open. And these were trades, by the way. My extra Alton cars went into this one and a couple Tyco things and the River Aussie Berkshire went into that one. Nice, okay, so here we have the 1377 Santa Fe Blue Goose Coach. I now have five, and I feel like I'm satisfied with the consist now that I don't have just four of them. Uh, the other truck is in here, it's in a bag. He just wanted to remove it for shipping purposes. So nice, there's that, awesome, okay. So now I have five Blue Goose cars, and I think honestly I'm going to stop there because of the nature of my engine. All right, now this big one over here is the one that I am super excited for. No spoilers as of yet, but if you guys have talked to me at all in recent days, you should definitely know what is in here, or at least have an idea of what to expect. I think this is one of those, yeah, it's just got like a big strip of tape on the inside. Now, without giving it away, the price I paid for this, I feel was fair. I didn't get away with the steal. It was definitely the biggest impulse buy I've ever had. It cost me right at $270 shipped to my front door. Okay, I don't want you to see the label on it, but let's go ahead and pull it out. Amazing. Not well packed, honestly. It's literally just sliding in there. So I'm a little bit nervous to open this up, but we're gonna go ahead and do so. Here we go. I'm just gonna check and make sure it's flipped the right way. It is not. Okay, here we go. Oh, yes. Look at that. The River Aussie Concours Hospital Train. Wow. It's got all seven cars, the locomotive, and I have not test run this yet. Apparently, it's supposed to be, like, essentially brand new. It's in gorgeous shape. Wow. I'm really excited to throw this on the track. At $260, or $270, excuse me, I don't feel like I could have done much better given how difficult these are to find. I saw it listed, the notification popped up on my phone that one was for sale, and I literally just didn't think I bought it. But anyways, um, wow, I am super excited. Very neat. And um, I don't know when I'll have the video out on this thing. I'll just show you the end of the box. 
he had 300 on it. I got it for three or 270, excuse me. Um, but yeah, limited edition set number two. I don't remember what the other numbers are. Anyways, um, now that I have the hospital train, I am two Hudsons away from having every single River Rossi Hudson they ever made. Hopefully, I'll have a Valley Flyer soon and then a Cardinals train afterwards. But anyways, there is going to be a video out on this guy and, of course, Big Phil and his cohorts eventually. But uh, unfortunately, likely not today. If today, very, very late tonight. So keep your eyes out for that. I'm super excited to share it with you. And that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time.